Live Model. It's a powerful and flexible environment for designing, evaluating, and optimizing the processes that drive your business. Its intuitive graphical user interface provides complete representation of the visual responsibility by using detailed process flow diagrams. In this webcast, we'll primarily focus on Live Model's integration with HP Quality Center. We'll also touch on the SAP Solution Manager and Microsoft SharePoint integrations, all of which can help you reuse your process assets across your entire landscape. Let's start by discussing the five phases that bring your processes to life within Live Model and Quality Center, from product implementation to test verification. In phase one, we'll cover the requirement strategy for rolling out Live Model. And two, we see how your processes come to life based on your used, custom, and standard SAP transactions. Phase three illustrates how in-scope processes are automatically populated within Quality Center. With a little help from our flagship product, Live Compare, in phase four, we'll witness the creation of test asset gap analysis reports and see how Quality Center test labs are automatically generated based on impacted scenarios. In the final phase, we'll validate our testing efforts within Live Model highlighting impacted processes that have not yet been tested. Here are the common questions that get addressed during live model implementation. What will your model look like? What systems or logical components should be represented within the global template? What level of detail should be captured within the model? Would you like your processes to be scenario driven or organized by application areas? What will you use for a baseline? Live Model has a standard process hierarchy available, and you can import SAP Solution Manager business process scenarios. We also support other third-party files. Now, most of our customers will use a hybrid approach, utilizing any combination of these options. You'll want to map in your custom transactions as well. Now, this is made easy with Live Compare's Use Custom Code Organization Report, which gets imported right into your process model. It organizes their custom code by application areas and development classes. And finally, you can define your roles and create or modify your flow diagrams. I'm now in Live Model, where you can see my business processes at their highest levels. I'll expand the sales and distribution hierarchy and select the sales order subprocess. Notice the two main tasks. I need to map in a third task that supports our custom sales order process. This is where that output from Live Compare comes in handy. It organized my use custom code by application area, so I can easily navigate to the transaction I'm seeking, Z mass orders, and simply drag and drop it to where I know it belongs. Here's the flow diagram for our sales order process. I'll need to link in my newly mapped custom transaction, which I know comes right after this multiple orders quotation task. This little toolbox makes it intuitive and easy. Click save and we're done. Now with our baseline complete and our custom code mapped, it's time for our process model to come to life. Live Model RFCs into your production environments and retrieves all of your used transactions and programs. This process is known as Live Capture, which provides a visual representation of your production usage on top of your process hierarchies and flow diagrams. What's not used is grayed out. Live Model walkthroughs are process recordings of your scenarios. This is an easy to use step by step process recorder. You may have one process flow diagram with several walkthrough recordings, one for each scenario. We'll first identify our used transactions and processes. Simply navigate through the live capture files and choose the appropriate one. Right click and select auto scope. Now let's create a walkthrough recording. I see there's one for standard sales orders, but I need one for our custom sales order scenario. Just expand the walkthrough explorer, create new, give it a name, and click record. Now I can step through the flow diagram based on the steps that support my custom sales order process.
Let's take a look at the finished recording. Imagine having a new employee in your organization playing these scenario walkthroughs. Not only will they have a better understanding of their responsibilities, but now they'll understand where their actions fit within the big picture. With our process hierarchy complete and our scenarios recorded, wouldn't it be nice to push this content into Quality Center? In phase three, we do just that. Your process hierarchy and live model populates your Quality Center requirements. And your scenario walkthrough recordings populate your Quality Center test plan. By clicking on design steps, we can see the details that have been recorded within live model, including your custom transaction, ZMAS orders. Right click on the process hierarchy and choose export to quality center. Let's log on to quality center and take a look. I'll just sign in and select a project. And here's my business process hierarchy completely populating my quality center requirements. Now select test plan. Navigate through the process tree. And choose the custom scenario that we just recorded in phase two. In design steps, we can see our T codes. In phase four, we introduce our Live Compare Impact Analysis Integration. Live Compare produces impact analysis reports by identifying the transactions and programs that you use in production that invoke the change objects within your transports, including support packs and enhancement packs. Live Compare then performs a match query on the executables that are impacted to the ones that are contained within your quality center test plan. This produces two deliverables. The first is a gap analysis displaying all the transactions that are impacted that are not part of any test plan. The second are the transactions that are impacted along with their related test plans. This deliverable automatically created your test labs. So when you log on to the Quality Center, all of your test labs have already been populated based on your impacted test plan scenarios. In Quality Center, select Test Lab, displaying all impacted scenarios that should be tested. In the final phase, test verification, Live Model RFCs into your QA system and identifies what has been tested. The transactions with the red circles around them have been impacted, and the ones with the green diamonds have been tested. Now in one graphic, we can see our used processes and transactions, along with their impacted and tested statuses. ZMAS orders. It's used in production, impacted by the transport, but not yet been tested. Select the process, then choose a live capture file. I'll select the one that displays impacted processes and transactions based on Live Compare's impact analysis. Next, I'll choose impacted and tested, validating our test cycle. For those who would like to populate SAP Solution Manager's business blueprint, you'll want to take a look at Live Model Solution Manager Integration Wizard. Now you can export your Live Model process hierarchy into your business blueprint. The hierarchy on the left is what you've modeled within Live Model. On the right-hand side, we can now see this content in Solution Manager. 
Here's an up-close look at Solaro 1 with a populated blueprint from Live Model, including all of the in-scope scenarios and transactions. Select the content you wish to push in the Solution Manager, and then choose the Update feature. In summary, Live Model integrates with all of your production systems, retrieving used executables, bringing your process model to life. The content in Live Model is then used to populate your Quality Center test assets, including requirements, test plans, and design steps. By utilizing LiveCompare's powerful impact analysis integration, we automatically generate your Quality Center test labs. I'd also like to note Live Model's integration with Microsoft SharePoint, where document folders and shortcut links are automatically generated. Our customers like this feature because it makes it easy to share process-related content throughout the organization. With the SAP Solution Manager integration wizard, we can populate your business blueprint with in-scope scenarios and executables. For more information on Live Model, please visit us at www.intellicorp.com.